before Thug Life, when you were with digital, working as a roadie and as and as a dancer, mm -hmm. was that real? When I mean, I just read that you used to like do dance, you know, the dances with the plastic. Do dance with the naked doll. That was me. That's what I mean by I'm real. I'm truly hardcore because I needed the money and I had to work. So if he told me that for me to get paid, I had to go out there in bikini briefs and hop on top of this doll, and that's how I got to get paid. And I was homeless at the time. That's what I had to do. You know what, what I'm saying? What, but what I did was not let him pimp me. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't like I just did that because that was my order. As soon as I got the chance to say what was on my mind, I said what was on my mind. And we have a platinum record now. You know what I'm saying? So I went from dancing naked with the dolls being unknown to now having a platinum record. You know what I'm saying? And, and now I don't have to never touch another naked doll. I'll never have to dance, jiggle, not knocking higher dances. You know what I'm saying? I got three people dancing. I can have people dancing in the audience. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Well, you have to work for one point to go to another point. So I admire the work ethic. I think that it should be reinforced throughout our neighborhoods, that everybody should work hard. Practice makes perfect. You have to be diligent about what you want. You have to apply yourself. You have to motivate yourself. And you have to do it for self, by yourself. And then you can do things for other people. But that's what I had to do. I had to do for self.